Welcome back. Let's take a look at what's happening here in these digital streets. The internet was buzzing because two white, able-bodied, conservative, straight, cisgendered males with unlimited means decided to hit the media circuit over the weekend and not only discredit claims that America is a racist country, but also completely disregard history. Here's what GOP Senator Lindsey Graham of South Carolina and former GOP Senator Rick Santorum of Pennsylvania had to say. Senator, is there systemic racism in this country in policing and in other institutions? Uh, no, not in my opinion. We just elected a two-term African-American president. The vice president is of African-American Indian descent. So our systems are not racist. We, we birthed a nation from nothing. I mean, there's nothing here. I mean, yes, we have Native Americans, but, if, but candidly, that, that, there isn't much Native American culture in American culture. Caucasians going to call Kate. I get that. But this was a pretty high level of caucasity. Lindsey Graham says there's no racism in America because we elected a black president. First of all, that black president was told that he wasn't even American. Half of America doesn't believe that he's even from here. They attached to him a whole other racist narrative that he was from Kenya. Not that anything would be wrong with being from Kenya, except he ain't. They also constantly attacked him, his wife, etc. They scream, you lie at his first joint uh, session of Congress. We could go on and on and on. But beyond that, the, the fact that a single black man is the business manager of a white supremacist patriarchal empire doesn't change the fact that it is just that, a white supremacist patriarchal empire. Black people getting killed on the street and they don't care whether Kamala's vice president, they don't care whether Obama was president. That ain't the point. We're dying. We're working harder for less money. We're, 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 we're getting longer sentences. We're getting executed at a higher rate. We're getting COVID at a higher rate. You can look at any measure of social prosperity, we at the bottom. Any measure of social misery, we at the top. So Senator Graham, you are sorely mistaken. And oh my God, Rick Santorum, you trying to tell me? You trying to tell me? that there's no Native American culture. Well, first of all, there's tremendous Native American culture and tremendous Native American influence in the United States. You wrong about that. But to the extent that you don't see it, it's because y'all killed them. You colonized, you used genocide, you erased people. Settler colonialism, settler colonialism is the reason why you don't see more Native Americans and more Native American culture. So please don't act like y'all just came over here with a religious mission. Y'all came over here to pillage, to destroy, to erase. And that's what you're saying. Don't think you slick when you said we birthed the nation. We know D.W. Griffith birth of a nation. We know the KKK propaganda film. We know what you're trying to do. And it's interesting that you are a CNN contributor. Cause sometimes when people work for CNN and say stuff offline, they get, you know what, we ain't gonna do that. We'll be back with more black news tonight, right after the break.